So again, it's Priscilla Batzel in Spring Hill, Florida at Expressionist Art Studio Gallery in the backyard with a pan of colors that I did not use in my last video. Not many of. I'm going to add some other colors to them shortly. But I think I'm going to start by using this 12 by 24 inch black primed canvas. And do I have a clean one? Yes, I do. I have an OXO omelet turning flip and fold spatula from, I said OXO, <laughs> best paint spreading tool around. I expect to use my shovel to apply those colors to this wet canvas once I make it so. And I may swipe, I may tip first. I'm probably going to use some black enamel to create some cells. The black enamel is an acrylic. You can find it in the craft section. It's not house paint. Although I have heard tell that you can use house paint. Must have been some wet paint of another color over there. I don't think it matters what other paint I'm going to get on here. I kind of need an edge catcher. I usually use one stuck right to my tile. That way, if I want to tip paint off, I can do that. Okay, it's it's very humid out here today, but it's also very hot. So I'm going to try and be somewhat quick. I'm also going to wipe off my spatula with my dampened studio rag and then finish with my paint rag clothes. Um, okay, so what I'm thinking of doing right now is moving that a little bit away. I have a rest an old towel rack from, you know, from a hot towel from a Chinese restaurant or something. So I'm going to take some of this paint and then I'm going to look at it and I'm going to add some colors that I want in there. Looks like that's not going to work, but this will. Get that out of the way. So, I'm not, I'm not going to be careful. And I might use all of my colors. The chances are good I won't. But like I said, I'm not going to be careful. I'm going to add some more colors I like to everything. This is a turquoise from Color Shift, from Folk Art that's Color Shift. One of these times I'm going to go, hey, I really like that. I'm not going to do anything to that. And that could happen any time. It wouldn't be a surprise. But I think if I get nice enough, oh, I got some really pretty colors in there. Even better than I expected by far. I'm going to throw a little bit of, where is the Venetian blue from Modern Masters? Nope, it's not coming out. I guess it's not going in there right now. Maybe a little more of that. I think some of my favorite folk art purple flash would be good in there. Just add in dribbles. I kind of want to just do some strange things like keep grabbing my paint and maybe I'll have some negative space left. You know what? I really want some more of that purple flash. I'm going to try and scrape my container out. I put a little bit more in there. It might be time for a new container, honestly, because I think this one's coated with so much paint I can no longer remove as much as I want from there. All right, so one more go round. I want that, I want the Venetian blue. That's all there is to it. Which means I'm gonna have to be patient. And hopefully you can join me. Pick up the right end of a skewer. It's so frustrating because you can push right in and you can see a nubby come out and you can pull it out and then you can go to screw your cap back on and it's still not clear because there's stuff behind the stuff you just pushed out. So I want to try some of this because I love it directly on the black because the black isn't thick enough for it to swallow it.
If I like it, I might do it with the other colors. If I like it more, I mean. Because I definitely like it. I'm going to be tipping, so probably we're going to lose some of that. Alright, so I put some turquoise in the front of this so I could... I may basting brush. It would be better if I did nothing and just left it because it's very cool. I like it a lot. I didn't leave myself any more paint though. I suppose I could just improvise. Because I've got all the colors next to me. Whoops. You know what? I think this is going to be a really short, short video. So I do sell my artwork. This is for sale. Well, maybe it isn't. I kind of like it more than that, more than to sell it. I could do all kinds of stuff. I could put chain in here. I could put basting brushes in. But um, because I like it so much, I don't think there's anything I want to do, except for maybe take some more colors out and dribble them wherever they happen to want to go. Because I think it's done. I say that, but you can't trust me. And you know that. At least not in as much as to say I'm done and, and mean it. I've got a mosquito trying to get into my right ear. <laughs> oh, wonderful. Go away. So should I go ahead and tilt a little bit? Should I drag a few skewer? You know what? I've got a nice paintball on the end of that. And I've got lots of wet paint. Let's see if we can do stuff with making tendrils that has very little to do with tilting and ruining what's already gorgeous for me. Especially that turquoise. Turquoise flash? No, it's a purple flash. I'm not sure what, what the exact name of the uh, folk art turquoise color shift is. I don't have much gold in there. I don't know if I need it either. I'm just sort of playing now. Just dipping my skewer in. Dragging a few things around, filling in. It's just very energetic. I know I can always add a few spirals. Until the paint dries at least. Yep, I'm liking the spirals. It'd be nice if I could have turned it into a dragon of some sort. But that might be coming. Let's do the other side. I'm just sort of there. I'm grazing the, the wet surface of paint with the uh, balled up end of that skewer. I don't know why I'm being so careful, because as long as the paint is wet, it will be cooperative. As soon as it gets gummy, then you've got a problem. I'm going to try and restrain myself. Oh, that paint's really heavy. Well, I do use GAC 800 by Golden in all my paint mixtures, which means that even though it's heavy, it won't crack when it dries. Knock on wood, somebody. Exotic jellyfish. It's all that comes to mind right now. I used to do things like this with ring pours. I kind of love my shovel pours, to tell you the truth. It's really, really, really all about the colors and, and letting them down on the surface freely. Yeah, I know, I said I was done and I'm still playing, but I'm having a good time and that's that counts. Just that little tiny touch of the, uh, the 24 karat gold that looks orange has some orange in it. 
just adds a lot. Just going kind of slow. Unusual for me, actually. I'm really glad I didn't tip this because I really like it a whole lot and I don't think I'm going to be the only one and I can turn it both ways and it still has a certain amount of balance to it. I can use some of the colors to touch over my edges if I want to finish it. I think I'm going to torch and tell you guys I love you and there's 88,000 of you or very nearly 88,000 of you subscribed. You might want to check and see if Phoenix Rising for Syllabats L Art is still in existence. If it is, there's no commercials over there. You know what? I really like the dots. They look kind of like bubbles. And I can steal color from anywhere. Yep, loving the dots. Yes, this is sweet. I really, really like this. And it doesn't have to be the same everywhere. It's very, very organic. I've got a torch in one hand. <laughs> I'm just holding the torch, ready for the moment I use it. Put that down. So, I should tell you guys all the things I usually tell you, which is I've got Teespring clothing under the video, and uh, it's all over print leggings and all over print t-shirts. And when you shop there, you help me out, the same as you, sh you help me out if you shop my Amazon link. Only there it's no added cost to you, and I really appreciate you guys. Thanks for all the wonderful contributions and comments that you've given me. The, the contributions will get you into the monthly drawing, where you can find the prizes for that drawing on the end screens in the exhibition video. In the last 20 seconds of any video, you'll find that exhibition video. I'm, I'm having way more fun than I was expecting, honestly. Um, I don't know why that would be true, because I always expect to have fun, honestly. Good. I used my paint, and I'm really happy with my result, and I really love you guys. Please subscribe if you're not subscribed, and welcome if you'd have. And I just threw one... I still want some gold, but I don't think I really need it, so maybe I have enough in there. I say that. You know I say that, and then... Let's see how I feel about it. Let's give it a try. Oh, yeah. Okay. Mistake. Maybe not a lot of them, but a few here and there, just to move the eye around. I have paint all over me today on my shoulders. See, right there on my bicep, <laughs> not my shoulder. I am in love with this. <laughs> what fun. I recommend shovels. If you haven't played with a shovel yet, go to your local dollar store and see if they've got them in for the summer, for the kids, for the beach, for the summer. And uh, cross your fingers, this dries okay, because I'm really happy with this. So let's actually torch and see what happens. If you wait too long and the paint begins to set up on its own, even though you need to torch to release the, the bubbles caught in the paint before they harden or pop while you're not looking, you might create patterns if you do it sooner than later, but I often torch too soon and then I want to play in the paint again. The nice thing about the gold dots is if there aren't enough of them, I can always add more and that's pretty cool. If you guys watch, long, watch the videos longer, you help me out. My placement gets better as you watch longer. Um, I really appreciate your thumbs up. Thank you so much for being generous that way and giving me a thumbs up. I really, really appreciate it. Um, what else did I not tell you? There's over 1,400 videos on my channel, and they're organized by playlists, all playlists, and by genres and topics, and by the hundred. And, um, I think we're pretty much covered, other than Facebook groups, Expressionist Art Studio Gallery Appreciation Group for students, and you can almost always find a video there, today's video, and the same on the community board. And if you ever have a question or you want to see an artwork, you can always ask me and I'll share it on the community board anytime, especially if you have an interest in purchasing something and you want to see the dry version. They're not always edited. It might take me a little time sometimes, but 
you give me incentive to go, <laughs> to get busy, and I appreciate that. I'm liking the turquoise. And as long as it's deep, even though I torched, it's so deep I can still steal some without doing any damage. And so can you. Because I can, because you can, because I can is my first book right next to my second book. The first one is called Because I Can. The second one is called Unlimited Possibilities. They are both on the Amazon link. Available to you on the link tree underneath the video. And my email address is right under there too. And I might want a few more gold dots. Maybe. Just a few. Like three. We'll see. I love you guys. I'll see you soon. Bye for now. I love you guys. I said that. But I do. I love you. Bye for now. See you soon.